So episode 5 of The Wolf Among Us is finally here, and as usual, we are going to do an entire walkthrough of it. So if you guys could be so supportive as to press the like button, share this around, subscribe if you're new to the channel, it'll really help out. And we are going to begin with The Wolf Among Us, episode 5, Cry Wolf. I mean, your eyes, and the teeth, you're not really supposed to do that, are you? If I can avoid it. No. Holly's sister, Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing if he if he cares about it. If he even gives a shit. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? We're destroying the tree. No! We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Look, uh, maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that to you. Oh, God, Big B! This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Big B, wait. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. So as you saw previously, you saw got you guys saw what happened in episode one through four, obviously. We finally found the crooked man. He turned out to be a guy with an extreme case of pink eyes, so <laughs> that guy's fucking weird as hell. Faith is dead. Bloody Mary is still a badass, even though she's a villain, and Let's just see what happens. I'm going to stop talking now. Hope you guys enjoy. Episode come 5, Crywolf. You must be tired. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Please, Sheriff. Relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really, a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. I told you, crooked man, it's over. Really? Yeah. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna. Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You know why I'm here. You killed those women. What women? Faith and Lily, the girls who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Did I know? 
I assume by your confidence in accusing me, you must have some proof of this, yes? Some allotment of evidence. Your servant over there told me it did it. That's a fucking lie! I didn't say anything like it's that! fine. All I said was that this was your town, and nothing wouldn't happen without your approval, all right? That's it. If only that were true. Those women. I don't relish telling you that the killings were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you, and to assure you that it's over with. An unfortunate bit of business? You're gonna tell me right now who killed him? Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. Oh yes the fuck you can, motherfucker. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? The man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? I'm the law here, not you. Now tell me who did it. Or what? You're gonna kill me too? Well, go ahead. You think I give a shit anymore? After what you did! That's enough! I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but... In the interest of preserving our alliance, if you have to know, it was Georgie. However, like I said, I'd be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie. You got what you wanted, so just... Sit. Down. Now. Yeah, I killed him, so what? You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. You piece of shit. I should have fucking known. Look, the fact is, George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this! And then you attempt me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss what to do with you. This is right, bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this? So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued. This guy doesn't what the seem hell? Take this fucker. trustworthy, Take but I didn't fucking Don't let's talk. See what he has to say because right. I'm not walking out of here let's with both talk. guys, obviously. You can't just hand me over. What the fuck is this shit? You said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You can't give a fuck if I'm the one. Who the shit do you think you fuckers are out the fuck out of here? I do apologize, Sheriff, but I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit, but he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what Holy the fuck? shit, which one You're do I gonna want? You're make sure we all go down this shitter with you? Get the fuck away from me! He's the one you fucking want! This could have gone so well. But you just had to complicate things. To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Ah, oh, shit. Bloody Mary. No. Fuck. <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you all fixed up. Holy shit! Here we go. The big fight. It's over. It's over! Over here! 
You're done, Wolf. Come on. We're pretty much done here. I should have grabbed him, man. I knew I should have did it. I should have grabbed the crooked man, but I couldn't. I'd like to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad to Come see Come on, there we go. Turned out. Get the fuck off me, Georgie. Yeah, right in the guts, motherfucker. Right in the guts. Kill him this time. We honestly should have killed him. I don't know why we didn't do it. I should have grabbed the crooked man. I played that all wrong, but he did say Georgie did it, and I want to take the guy who murdered the females in. So whatever. Come on, Georgie. Oh, shit! I know. Go, here we go. Are you telling me that I'm this fast? Holy shit, I'm fast as hell. Nice, let's keep going. Left. Nice, jump again, jump again, sick, Oh shit, here we go, we're gonna get him, we're gonna get him. I missed, what? Fuck no. Fuck, what was that? Okay, it said I almost missed that jump. Oh wow, wrong car! No! Crooked man was in that other one. Ah, oh, man didn't know. Kill this girl already. She's annoying. Come on, A button, A button, A button, A button, A button, A button. Fuck, I didn't have. I didn't do it in time. Shit. Here we go. Gun it. Are you sure? Do it. Here we go. He's not moving. Keep going. Are we going to chase them around the entire town all night? Holy shit. This is fun. Fuck. Come on. Fuck it. I had no idea that the crooked man was in another car, but ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed that first short part of the Wolf Among Us episode 1, I mean episode 5, part 1, I will be back with more, sorry the video is so short, but I have something to do, really important, so I have to make it 15 minutes long, 
Thank you guys for watching. Press the like button, share this around. I'll be back with more. Take it easy.